dark in here, huh? Isn't it dark in here? So, um, the microphone is not turned up too loud. I learned to turn the microphone off. Conspiracy theory shit. You don't want your mic on. There you go. Is that better? Is that better? Is that better? Yo, testing. This is for Mrs. Chambers and the Trash Girl Mafia. This is a YouTube battle. Your master, the trash man, started the battle by saying, my wife and my daughter, blah, 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 yakety, yak, smackety, dappity, dap, yappity, smackety. I retaliated and told the masked man to put on the mask and talk shit. Ever since I told him to put on the mask, I've been attacked by trashaholics. He started it. He came out. And I shut it down. If you can't understand that your hero can have mythological battles without needing help from his mythological minion, then understand this known fact. When you slap somebody upside the head and they stand there and they slap you back and you pretend like you ain't never swung, that is bitch made activity. Don't hit me, walk away and expect somebody else to take up your battle. So I hit back. Then I hit back. And there's been several skirmishes between me and the trashaholics. Then, of course, like I said, they, they always go after the people that watch your videos, the people that like you, your, your friends, your true viewers, your YouTube family. And when they go after your YouTube family, it, it sucks because these innocent people have nothing to do with it. I don't have no realaholics, the bunch of people that want to go just start shit because somebody dislikes my video. That is the power of this YouTube thing. Your leader, your master started up this fictitious fight. And I took it to the next level. In the same manner in which he did. If the flunkies of the trash man, the trashaholics, if all these little trashaholics don't understand that the battle is between me and your master... Not the minion, but see, you want to take up his fight because you think you have to fight for Trash Man so you can be in one of his little porno videos. I know that's what y'all women want. You do all this bad mouthing people on YouTube, and the trash go through there and pick y'all out to be in movies with him. Come on, dummies. Please. Please. Whatever he do to make his movies, that's his money. I'm not trying to mess with nobody's money. I ain't going there. This is just to let you know. In good spirited fun, he slapped the shit out of me. And in good spirited fun, I slapped the shit out of him. He said, won't somebody talk shit? He wanted a battle. And that's what he got. He got somebody to battle him. I ain't got no ill will against him, but I can clown just like he can. A long time ago, this is a true story. I had just moved to the city I'm in, and we used to all hang out at this laundromat. I go in the laundromat, these two girls, loud mouth ass little sisters, thought they was the shit, and they was talking fat shit about me. Didn't even fucking know me from anybody. So back in the days, I used to play the dozen like no other. I grabbed these little Suns so some shades and shit and popped the lenses out and I put the frames of the glasses on and I acted like I was a preacher and I clowned them two little girls for about 15-20 minutes. They went and got the biggest nigga in town to fight me because I disrespected his auntie. You can talk about my mama but I can't talk about your shit done played out with me since way back then. 
I done fought a many motherfuckers over talking bad about me and me talking bad back. And uh, I'm not the motherfucker going to sit here and sit back and let some clown try to clown me and laugh at my expense. I can clown too. So if trash, wait, 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 this, this is not right. So, if Trash wants to still continue this battle, we can. But if the Trashaholics want to still fight the battles for you and harass people and yada, yada, yada and come all off the hook, remember this. It takes one person saying the wrong thing to somebody else and this is not a threat. Loose lips sink ships. Card houses tumble. Watch how you play people. Because one day, one of these people that you play is not going to play that same game. I'm not the kind of person that will fall in a trap. I told one other person about what I really do know. And that person like, they're trying to sucker you in to say some shit ain't real. And I'm not going there. So please, what I think is supposed to be real may not be. But don't sucker me or try to sucker me into saying something about you, dude. That ain't true to make you look good. But if what was said about you is true, I regret the day that I got that information. And that is something you do not want me to talk about on the international world wide web. So now, let me get back to the clowning and foolery. Trashaholics, leave my people alone. If you want to battle me, battle me. We can have fun all day fighting each other, making up stories about how bald-headed your mamas is. I said it. Play with it. This ain't serious. Stop trying to take it serious. God damn. This is only fucking YouTube. This is this is not even TV. This This what? What? What would possess you to think that this is real life? When someone starts off with a made-up fictional story, this is YouTube based on YouTube. Didn't you see the video where I was the gangster with the crown on my head? This is fucking YouTube, kids. So... Trashaholics, get one thing straight, to battle is to battle, that's fun. But don't make something personal if you do not even want it personal, because even if the information that was linked to me isn't true, for somebody to say what they said to me is fucking foul. And I'd be less... Trashaholics, this is your final warning. Trash man, you're going to have to find a mediator in this one.